Hey friends, good morning. Steve here from Icon Jiu Jitsu Team Owning. Today we're talking about our skills program. It's one of the things that I often hear when people bring their um, the, the, the ninjas in to, to try our skills program is that they always complain that their child is totally addicted to video games. And, you know, and it's like the brain drain. Why? Why are these guys, why are these kids so addicted to video games? So you often say, oh, my child has no focus. And but when you put them on a video game, they just, just become like addicted to this thing. Like they zone out to work on it. Um, specifically, uh, the age group, I think, which is the biggest that is coming off of nine, going into the 10 to 14 year olds is where um, you're going to see a big sort of addiction to this thing. And it's not any other reason apart from science. It's what's happening in their growth in the stage of development. And it's simply this. So when a, 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 a preteen, let's say, sort of 10 plus, um, get to that, that level, their brain starts to go from an adolescent brain to an adult. It's starting to change, starting to rebuild. They've got the workmen in. They're in there. They're building. They're taking the old stuff down. They're putting the scaffolding up in there, uh, and they're building. And the thing that happens is it gets built. All the energy goes to the back of the brain first, which is where all your memory, your facts, your science is stored. So that means if all the energy is going there, somewhere the energy is not going. And that is this front bit here. Um, so in this front bit where we have all our good, we make our good choices, our reasoning, our moods. Um, well, of course, now that's very deficient. Um, and that's where dopamine is created. Uh, dopamine is that reward system. I feel good for doing something. Also, there's another chemical we need to focus on. It's called serotonin, which says satisfaction. I did it. So what do video games give, do you think? Uh, reward system? Satisfaction? Yes. Okay, so there's no, um, there's no mystery to why people get this age group gets addicted because it's so like it gives me the things that I'm missing. We've got bunches of cortisol running through our brain, but it's given me the things I'm missing. I'm missing that dopamine. I'm missing that serotonin. So now I'm going to find this thing that gives it to me, which is video games. I get rewarded. I get satisfaction when I get to the next level. I get rewarded for doing it. And that's how dopamine and serotonin. OK, and because, of, like I said, all the energy is back here being pumped in here. When it get, finally gets to the front, it's a weakened amount a distributed amount of energy so there's no secrets as to why it's happening it's, it's just pure science but if you just play video games to get these dopamine and serotonin um you're missing you're missing your other chemicals you need releasing you're missing them you know you need dopamine you need the oxytocin which is meaning serotonin but of course endorphins which is why um sports and social um, activities do really well because they give you the missing hormones. If you just get that overload of uh, dopamine and serotonin and not the others, that can lead to a weak immune system, depression, mood swings, moodiness, grumpiness, tiredness, that type of thing. Um, so, you know, the, the, the dopamine and serotonin is that desire. I, I, my, the video games give me, I'll, I'll, I want to, I'm addicted to this because it gives me that. So there's no... There's no, um, like I say, there's no secrets. It's simply what's going on in the brain. You've got to think they're going from an adolescent to an adult. It's changing. It's being rebuilt. You know, it's not It's not free. When you rebuild something, you know, it takes energy. For example, when, when we were babies, or if you have a baby, you'll see it sleeps a lot of the time. Why? Because everything, the body's building, like, like, it, like, like our preteens, they've got growth spurts. But the brain's building. It's why they sleep. If you have puppies, they sleep a lot because, hey, it's building. It needs energy to build. Energy is not free. And so all that energy goes there. And that's why uh, kids around about this age love video games because it is giving them something that they're not getting. What we do here at Skills is we understand these things. So we have drills that do reward them and give them supply of dopamine. We do give them the satisfaction of what we're doing. We have many drills and skills that we work on to do this. Um, and of course, we're going to be releasing those ones, uh, oxytocin and endorphins that they're missing. OK, they're missing these ones by just playing video games, like I said, which could lead to uh, weak immune system, depression, mood swings, etc. So what we're doing is we're bringing them in and we have a program designed to help them. Um, so video games in moderation are not a bad thing. But if they're just on their own with nothing else, then you're going to see some problems emerging.